<laughs> all right. We'll figure out what's going on with these clouds when Lauren joins us again. <laughs> well, we could all use a little happy this Monday morning, right? Joining us this morning is mindset expert and co-founder of Spread Happy, Andrea Villali. And this month we're talking about relationships. Yes. But not just, you say there's one relationship that you really need to focus on. Let me guess, let me guess. Okay, guess. Yourself. That's Yay! right, yay! <laughs> I am Somebody learning. Somebody is really learning. <laughs> Somebody's paying attention. Yes, the most important relationship that we have is with ourself. So if you were to build a house, you wouldn't start building on the second floor. You would start building the foundation. So here's what's so beautiful. The relationships that we have in our life are like mirrors of ourself. So when there's discord in a relationship, we get to actually look at ourself and say, where is this fear in me? Where is this discomfort in me? How is the inner child being affected? Mm -hmm. So if a child were to come to you and say, I'm upset, I had a bad day at school, the kids don't like me, I didn't do well on a test. How would you treat the child? You would treat the child with love and compassion. You would say, you know what, it's a test. You, you'll, there'll be plenty of opportunities for other tests. You're perfectly perfect the way you are. You would give that child love and compassion. And that's the part of us that really needs to be nurtured. It's this fear that we have inside of this discomfort. It's not coming from the outside of us. It's coming from the inside of us. All right, but I hear the term inner child. I yes. know, I know. And it's like warning, warning, <laughs> okay, hocus here's the pocus, deal. you know? I'm, I'm not super comfortable with that term either. I use it because a lot of people can relate to that. Mm -hmm. yeah. You can call it the fear. You can call it the discomfort. But what we want is we want to have a relationship with that fear and discomfort so that it doesn't take us out. So we want to fill ourselves up because here's the deal. No one outside of us can fill us up. That fulfillment has got to come from us. But how do you do that? Okay. So if when something triggers us in a relationship, if we can step outside of it for just a moment and recognize what it is and nurture that, actually look at it from an outside perspective as a parent would look at a child. How would you treat that child? What would you say to that child? Well, can so, you give us a real wor world example? Okay, so here's a for instance. Mm -hmm. What you want from other relationships, give to yourself. So if you want love and compassion, from another relationship. Give that love and Validation. compassion to yourself. Mm -hmm. Yes, because it's that negative self-talk that takes us down, and that negative self-talk is what calls the discord. So if we had a child, and I use a child because it's an easy example, mm -hmm. because we feel compassion for children. If we had a child that was ha experiencing negative self-talk, we would give that child compassion. We would say, You're it's, not stupid, it's you're okay. not right. lazy, you're not, it's whatever yeah. we tell ourselves. Yeah, and those feelings are valid, and mm -hmm. you can start fresh, you can start again. What if you just have an annoying partner? <laughs> well, <laughs> we'll get to that next week. We'll get to that next week. We're doing a month long on relationships. Okay. Yes, we've, we've got to start with the self. It's like if you're driving a car and the car doesn't have gas, you can't get anywhere. We've right. got to fill up our own gas tank. In the case of relationships, two halves do not make a whole. All right, and we are going to be joined by Andrea and her husband, Lee. Yes. Is Lee here today? Yes. He is, okay. On Facebook Live at 10.15 yes. to continue this conversation because yes. apparently we can talk for a while <laughs> yeah, about this. this is a great <laughs> conversation. So, but if you want to hear more, join us on our Facebook page, CBS 12 News Facebook page at 10.15 yes. with Andrea Perfect. and her husband. All right, thank, thank you. Yeah, you. we'll have a lot of fun. <laughs>